Hi folks, welcome back to another tutorial for earning your assessment stripes with PowerTeacher Pro. In today's video, we're going to learn how to create an assignment. To create an assignment, I'll make sure I'm in the section that I want to create the assignment for. So in this case, it's my English language arts class and I'm going to click create assignment. All right, I'm going to go to my information from my language arts consultants. So we are going to do this assignment called Reading, Thinking Within the Text. I'm going to come right back here. I'll put in my assignment name. I know that this needs to be classified as a progress check. I'm going to make sure that my score type is collected only because I'm an elementary teacher and we do not use numeric scores at all. So it's always going to be collected only. And then I'm going to select my due date. So because this is an ongoing uh, assessment, then I'm going to select a due date way far in the future. So sometime before um, the summary report becomes available for parents. So I'm just going to choose the 15th of January. That works for me. And if I was going to do this as a discrete assessment, so something that's a single event, um, for example, like a science test, then I would choose the actual date uh, that we do the science test. Then I'll scroll down to description. And I will paste it right in here. If I wanted to, I could even insert a link. I can format this information so that it's easier to read and my parents can see it. All right, I'm not gonna save and close yet, but I am gonna save just to be sure. Then I'm going to come here to my outcomes. So when I click on outcomes, we need to make sure that we're on the tab called add edit outcomes. And then I'm going to look for the outcomes as recommended um, for this assignment, or if it's a different assignment, it's not this one, it's one I'm making up on my own, then I need to make sure that the outcomes I select are aligned with those that are being assessed for this assessment. So in this case, for quarter one and quarter two, I'm going to use 2.1.3 and 2.2.4. I can use as many as I need, but for our purposes today, I'm going to add just those two for now. So now I'm going to go to my show selected outcomes and I'll see that I have these uh, all ready to go. Then I'm going to go to publish. This is where I need to be careful. If this is an ongoing assessment and I want my parents to see what I'm doing over a long period of time, then I want to be able to publish that assignment right away. In this case, since our due date is January 15th, if I publish on that due date, anything that I put in there, like comments and feedback for the student, it won't be visible for the parent until that due date. I want my parents to be able to see what's going on with their child's reading right away. So in this case, I will choose immediately. And then I will save and close. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how we create an assignment in Teacher Pro. That's it for today, everyone. If you have any questions, please do give us a call at St. Peter's Center. Thanks for watching and have a great day.